Peekaboos! Halloween is coming up, so I thought it would be fun to try and win a Halloween theme plushie for my next Tareba video. So as you can see here, we have a Pikachu wearing a witch's hat, which I think is super cute. So we're going to see how many tries it takes us to win this plush. So let's go. So it is in one of those machines where you just kind of have to push it off the ledge. So with these, you want to not move the claw so centered. You want to give it a little bit of give. So you want to move it more towards one side. So um, let's try maybe back around here. Oh no! I stabbed it, so I definitely didn't go over enough. So we're going to have to try again. Um, more to the right is what I'm talking about. All right, that looks to be a little bit more over. And we'll go ahead and let's try grabbing its butt. See if that does anything. No, that wasn't... Wow, I'm not going over enough. So let's try going right back here around the neck. Okay. So let's see if we push them. Oh, hmm. Okay. So it only grabbed them a little bit, so I might have gone over too far because the booty looks a little bit further over, but maybe now, I don't, did I go over enough to grab the booty? I'm not quite sure, but, oh no, I didn't go, oh wait, maybe. Come on, push them. Oh, okay. I need to go slightly a little bit more over and I think the booty is the way to go. Lightly more over. That was more, right? I don't remember where I put it. I should be paying attention to these things. Okay. Oh no, okay. I was like, I can't see, it lagged. All right, come on, tip him. Yes, okay, this is what we want to do. So, oh, ah, okay, yay, we got him. How many tries with that? I don't know, I'll put the counter up as I'm playing so you guys can know how many tries that was, but we got the plush. So that's super exciting. Now we have a fun Pokemon Halloween plush to display for the holidays. So I found another one of these push ones. So we're gonna give this one a try. It's a cute laying down Mamashiba plush. So you guys know how much we love that one. So let's see if we can win her. Looks like a couple people had already started this. And if I don't stop talking, <laughs> I might um, end up missing out. So we're getting going here. Let's see how well this can push. Oh, I don't know if I went over enough, so it might not... Yeah, I mean, I went too far over, so it didn't really grab her. So let's try again, not so far over. Not that much. Oh gosh, no, what happened? <gasps> no! Okay, okay, we can still try for the butt. <laughs> Major lag there, but we will try for the furthest part on the butt. Okay, we moved it <laughs> a tiny, tiny bit. So let's try back for the head and try to do what I was going for before we got major lag. Back behind the head. And I think we're getting her right behind the ear. Oh, oh no, we stabbed her. So a little tiny bit further. Oh, I don't even know. We're gonna try more for the neck, less for the ear because we didn't go over as much. Oh no! Oh, maybe I should have tried for the nose with that one. A little bit further over. Oh gosh, did I go over enough? I don't know. We'll go back for the neck. Maybe? Okay, slide around. Okay, good. That's good. Come on, pull her. No! It didn't do anything. All right, maybe we should try back for the butt because the butt should be lighter. See if that does anything. Oh, I think I wanted to go a little bit further back. Oh no. All right, let's go back for the booty. Move slightly over a little bit more. Okay, that might be good. We're actually gonna go, because I guess her leg's in the way. So we're gonna go for the leg area. See if we can get it. Ooh, that was not good. Oh wait, maybe. Oh, perfect! That was a good grab. Let's go for the butt again. We actually got in between here, the leg and the butt, and it pulled it. 
I don't know if we tried for that leg if it would do anything because it's such a, a small lightweight piece but now that we've got her here you don't have to go over as far so we've got the tail which actually the tail is it's doing us some good here I think because the head is so heavy that it's harder to move it over and if we can get the butt off then we can just push it and get it over over not too far back towards that booty oh I didn't go back enough but maybe nope okay gotta go back a little bit further either that are a little bit more over so we can actually grab that leg maybe because I don't know now that the booty is more straight I'm not sure how we'll be able to get it so I think I moved over a little bit more and just go back again towards the booty I definitely went over more so we're grabbing the leg oh so look she's like kind of hanging off okay we got the little piece of the leg so that might give it a good oh okay we might want to go underneath the leg now either that or try for the head again now that she's more over the side not quite sure let's try for the booty one more time see if we can do anything kind of maybe grab under that leg towards the edge of the booty there <gasps> no okay oh it was lagging a little bit I was like am I gonna go too far where is it okay so we scooped the leg but it, we were a little bit too right so it didn't grab as much it didn't have so much resistance so there wasn't as much pull so I think that's the way to go I think this is where we want to head it's like all about timing and where we grab it so it's a little tricky and because it's not as rolly as the Pokemon one it's a little bit harder okay did we go too far over again oh okay this is good this is good look how far she is now so I think another good push or two on the leg just like that we'll be able to snack her don't want to go as far over and am I getting some lag here oh no okay I guess we'll just try to push down on the booty seeing how I let go way too soon because I thought it was lagging and it clearly was not but okay we got behind the tail though so we really don't have to go too far over the tail is so flimsy though obviously that's not gonna do much okay so we've got under here come on grip it oh look at that she is so close I don't know if it's a booty grab or if we just do this if it'll push it enough let's do another booty grab go for the booty again I'm saying booty a lot in this video I think we need a booty counter <laughs> Exactly where I want it but there's that plastic piece oh oh yay! so uh, we just won the cute little mama Shiba I'm not quite sure if that one is a Shiba Inu or if that girl one there is more of the Pomeranian style because if you look here her ears are a lot bigger than these two and then of course we got the roly-poly pug but yay it took us a few more tries than the Halloween Piku Piku Pikachu plush <laughs> but we were able to snag them and Dan is making so much noise in the kitchen I should have shut the door so I'm sorry for all the background noise in this video oh they have the gray pupper now but you know what I think I'm gonna stop here I'm not gonna push my luck because I only have like 9,000 TP left which is about three tries or so and I kind of don't want to spend any more today but I hope this video helped you guys out on how to play these machines you do have to get the arm closest to the plushie as you can where it almost looks like it's not gonna make it around that way you can get the biggest push out of one turn that you can and it's best to try to get one side off you didn't really see that with the Pikachu plush because we got really lucky and he just rolled right in which is another thing depending on the type of plush it might be easier if it's a more rolly kind of plush they're obviously going to go in easier than ones that lay flat like these Mamashibas but if you get one of the edges off then the other side with gravity should just pull it right down so yeah that was my Taraba plays today I hope you guys all enjoyed and I'll see you guys next time bye Pika Blues
we need a booty counter. But booty, the booty, the booty, the butt, the butt, the butt, the butt booty, butt butt, butt booty, booty, the booty, the booty, booty, the booty, booty grab, another booty grab, booty, booty.